Can Zeppelin slow biological age? Am I really 87 years old? Just kidding, I'm Elizabeth, I'm Countess of Shopping. I'm not 87 years old, but I have been on GLP-1 medication over the last 20 full months and have lost over 93 pounds. And on today's episode, I've got an it's actually from Business Insider, but they are citing a scientific uh, study, which I will link down in the description link below. Just click the dot, 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 more button. I love being fact-checked. I love making sure I, uh, well, I require myself to be accurate. So correct me if I'm not, but this article is so amazing about slowing down biological age. Um, say researchers say so the weight loss injections and they're alluding to glp1 medication so that's the umbrella of ozempic and wegovy semiglutide terzepatide majaro zepbound um are showing that semiglutide studies have found semiglutide reduces inflammation regardless uh, of whether users lost weight the times of london reported i find this so fascinating because we're finding out more and more, for example, people with rheumatoid arthritis, there's studies going on about how it can reduce flare-ups for people with rheumatoid arthritis, and that the inflammation of taking GLP-1 medications is fascinating. And I've noticed that for myself too. I have had really creaky knees, and I just assumed that my creaky knees stopped creaking as much because I lost a ton of weight. <laughs> but it's also showing, these studies are showing about the inflammation component of it too. And many of you guys in my free encouragement group have said the same thing. So in this article, it goes on saying that, um, that uh, there's a number of studies presented on Friday at the European, and this by the way was from August 31st is the article, 2024. The European Society of Cardiology Conference found that the pricey drugs, I love how the media throws in these like jabs. It is pricey though, I mean, hello. We're like all paying like semi-mortgage payments and rent money. <laughs> <laughs> for these men. Well, I shouldn't say we're all. That's that's not a nice thing to that's not true. We're paying oh, a penny or our insurances. Um, it's initially marketed as a diabetes drug, and then now they've been under FDA approvals for other things. Um, it's reduced inflammation through GLP-1 medication, regardless of whether users lost weight, the Times of London reported. According to the report by Harlan Krumholtz, a professor of medicine at Yale University who edits the Journal of American College of Cardiology where the study was published, said that the drug, meaning GLP-1 drugs, um, somehow quieting inflammation and adding the benefit was broad. There's a, not a group that doesn't seem to be benefiting, which hello, when I started this 21 months ago, you don't know how many people are like, you're going to have five heads. And now I'm like, ha oh. ha. I had the last laugh because it's helping things like preventing 20 or it's lowering cardiovascular events, strokes by 20%. Um, they're looking into for cancer, preventing can certain, certain kinds of cancer. Like there's so many other side benefits. It's so cool. It's so cool. It feels very good to be vindicated. Um, they're saying it's a fountain of youth. I would say that if you're improving someone's cardio metabolic health substantially, then you are putting them in a position to live longer and live better. So that was Harlan um, Krumholtz the professor of medicine at Yale University. <clears throat> it's not just avoiding heart attacks. These are health promoters. It wouldn't surprise me improving people's health. <clears throat> excuse me. As I have like a Louie come up, I have, excuse me. Um, it slows down the aging process. Experts also suggest the drug could be used to treat linked um, other conditions linked to inflammation. Cancer, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's per the Times of London, which we've talked here before too. If you've got somebody who's in your family who have, if you are like genetically predisposed to those, watch my other videos down on the play playlist on those. You can just type in like Countess of Shopping in the playlist and look up like cancer and the other side benefits. It is staggering to me. So they did this study. It was a select trial tracked by 17,604 adults aged 45 years old and older for up to five years as they were given once weekly injections of 2.4 milligrams of semaglutide or a placebo. The participants were overweight or, over, or, or obese and had cardiovascular disease, but no history of diabetes. Researchers found that those who took the drug died at a lower rate from all causes, the BBC reported. The Danish company Nova Nordisk, the maker of Wegovy and Ozempic, already announced the headlines of the study in August last year, saying semiglutide 2.4 milligrams reduced the risk of major adverse cardiovascular events by 20% in overweight or, over or obese adults in the trial. So 
this we're going to talk a little bit too in this episode also at the end i'll talk more about some of the anti-aging things i've noticed and what i'm using to to help facilitate with that as well but it goes through and talks about about potential dangerous side effects of course they need to include that too because there are some gnarly ones talk to your healthcare provider about those um and they're also saying this is not a quick get get a quick fix for beach body ready um people too they always have to put that in there as well and so I found this was interesting about going back to the biological aging, if we're helping with the inflammation component. And that to me was the whole nugget of this article that I wanted to pull out with some of my opinions on there. And again, I'll link this and as well all my, my stuff down on the, the description link below about the inflammation component. If you think about your own body of taking a GLP-1 medication, and I know many of you watching this, probably many of you who do watch my videos are researching you have yet to take GLP-1 medication, but for the people who do take GLP-1 medication, if you can think about where the inflammation is, for me, for sure my body, I, I noticed just in like swelling, um, particularly for my ankle, I had had ankle surgery and really bad inflammation around my joints. And so that also included my creaky knees, but also like my ankles and joints and things like that. And I just don't really have that now. I assumed it was because of I was losing weight, <laughs> but they're saying in this study that it was regardless of weight loss. It was just in general. And that to me is fascinating because we know that inflammation, like the article said, do contribute to things like Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, cancers. It has more of an inflammation um, byproduct of those. And again, I'm not medical at all. So always talk to your own healthcare provider, but making my own experience, strength, and hope of this, it has been fascinating to see. And so with that anti-aging process, the other benefit of that is that I feel like I am turning back the hands of time and my aura ring, it tells me like my, um, I forget how they word it, but it's basically like my, my like metabolic age or my biological age based on fitness. And I was like, dear Lord, when it first came out, it was still tracking it. I'm like, dear Lord, please let it not be like 75. <laughs> and it said on there, my aura ring, which I'll link, it's on my Amazon shopping, my zip on Amazon shopping list. Um, it was like, it's your age or I'm like one year less. And my goal over this year is to make it like five years less. I have no idea if that's realistic or not, but who, you know, I'm gonna try for it. I, I'm gonna try for it because I'm being so physically active because I'm able to do stuff because my knees aren't crinky because my ankle's not cracking and, and, and swollen up like a, a, a football. Like I'm able to do more physical stuff which is helping with the biological age and um, the specific age that they're saying on here, they're calling, yeah, they're so, saying slow uh, biological aging. And so that to me is fascinating is, is like, it begets more and more and more, like the shot begets uh, anti-aging and anti-aging begets more, like it's, it's fascinating to me that this is, and it was an unexpected byproduct of taking this, that I knew that it would help my health. I just didn't know 21 months ago, <laughs> how much it would affect so much of my health of like this. I feel like I have the golden ticket. <laughs> I feel like I'm on Willy Wonka's Charlie and the Chocolate Factory of like, I got picked to take the golden ticket with this changing my life. And I've had to do the work. I always like to say it is literally a zip bound is but a tool <laughs> and Manjaro is but a tool and semi-glutide and terzepatide and all the GLP-1 umbrella. It's but a tool. I have to do the work because there still is work. It's not just like a magical for me, I've had to work at this. And some people do just have, but to make permanent sustainable lifestyle changes, that's my ultimate goal. I'm not paying all this money <laughs> not to change my life and not to learn how to eat well and work out and do all these things in a healthful category. And so this, this, this article really gives me a lot of hope, you know? And I've talked about this on previous shows before, but living longer that had that did have a moment of where it has terrified me, where I've like woken up and been like, I'm gonna run out of money. <laughs> I thought I was gonna die earlier. And our retirement savings and planning financially, like we've revamped that. We've, we definitely have looked at revamping that. And I don't know if you've had that conversation with yourself or with your partner of financially because it's saying my age, like it's changing aging, that I'm, uh, statistically speaking, I'm gonna live a lot longer. I, I got a plan for that. And so it's interesting to me for our financial planners in the audience and people who are in like the financial planning industry and retirement and stuff like that, like, yeah, I am gonna live long, like this, I thought I was gonna die much earlier. And so that has revamped for us some planning and some changing of, of our strategy, like with our finances. Um, and there's many, like that is but one facet of the changes that we've made in terms of biological aging too, right? Like literally we're planning a vacation right now 
And the conversation is, like, what are, physical activities are we going to do? And it's not like, oh, I can't do it. What are we taking off the list because we don't have time? Before, it was like, what are we taking off the list because I can't do it. I don't want to do it. I'm not interested in it. I am interested in all of it. I'm like, put me outside. Let me be outside and play. It has completely changed my physical stamina of what I want to do, where I want to invest my free time in. Like, it is beautiful outside right now. I just want to go walk and walk and walk and walk and be outside. And so... I think that that's one of the other byproducts of this too, of like thinking of the larger scope of this, of like the health of, it's not just about losing weight for chronic obesity management patients. It, it's it's so much more than that that this encompasses. It's touched every area of my life. My relationships are different as a result of GLP-1 medication. Like, And I've talked about that in other videos too, of like that's changed a lot of dynamics with my relationships as I've lost weight, that in itself, but also the way I feel about things. I mean, it's just changed a lot, a lot. A lot has changed. So much has stayed the same, but so much has changed, if that makes any sense. And so anyways, I found this article fascinating because of the inflammation point, regardless whether the users lost weight. And so people who are hypo losers, one of my big messages I wanted to share with you today too is like, this is great news. Like if you're a hypo loser and you're like, I'm not losing weight, I'm so frustrated. But know that it, per this article from the Times of London reporting on this with the study, that it's still helping with inflammation. And that it, the, more studies need to be done on all this, of course. Like, we are at the very genesis of GLP-1 medication. There's, but like, retitrutide hasn't even come out. That's like two to three years before it comes on the market, which I will be first in line, literally have my ticket ready. I will be ready to go talking to my healthcare provider to get retitrutide. I want that so badly, it sounds right out, because I'm at Zepbound 15 milligrams. I'm at the highest possible dose. So, I hope that gives you some encouragement today. Some of the anti-aging things I like to talk about too, because my life has changed so much and I do like sharing about these. The number one thing you can do for anti-aging, like if you're looking for your face and body, sunscreen. If you are not wearing your sunscreen right now, I want to be a very good friend and be like, get some dang sunscreen today and put it, slap that on your face and on your neck and your decollete. And if your arms are exposed or whatever's exposed, <laughs> get some sunscreen. For my face currently, and I change it every month, like I love trying new products, but currently what I'm using, and I will put this on my Amazon beauty shopping list because I know sometimes you guys like to take my recommendations because I'm not going to lead you astray. <laughs> like I bought these. I won't share them if I don't like them. I just don't talk about it. But this one I really like um, and I'm going to mispronounce it. It's the L to MD. It's the UV daily 40 SPF. And then also a viewer had recommended this. It's color science. It's SPF 50 and it's like changes with, it's like a light tinted moisturizer. It changes with the color of your face. Um, it's really cool. It's really, really cool technology. Like it's heat sensitive, David. That's my more Rose impersonation for you. So those are my SPF. First out of the gate, anti-aging. Get some SPF on your face to start protecting it from some damage that you'll see later on down the pike. Next, dry skin. <laughs> uh, I have pulled this bad boy out because it's starting today. It got really, really like much colder. And also the, you could feel the weather was drier. And I was like, bam, I got out my belief Hydra, is it, what's it called? True Clearing. I almost called it, it's a moisturizing bomb. And I like this. It helps my skin because when my skin gets really dry, which today it did underneath my eyes, I had to put on some more eye cream. It looks dry, which it looks wrinkly. And so having just moisture, which tag teams on water, this is your friendly reminder. It is get your water in and how you choose to get your water in is your business. But a couple ways I do it is of course with Element Electrolytes. I love electrolytes. It still counts as water with an electrolyte in there. Those, they've given us eight free sticks with any purchase. That's linked down below. That's not on my Amazon list. I put it on my Amazon list, but get it directly from the vendor so you can get the eight free sticks. And then also directly from the vendor is the Clean Simple Eats Collagen. Collagen has been my, people ask, what have you been doing in the last few weeks and changing it up? Collagen. I used to talk a lot about collagen. I stopped for some weird reason, I don't know. And so I've gotten really very much back on the collagen train, collagen. And I like these, these are, fru I like fruity taste. Now I have savory and I have fruity. This is the fruity ones. They're sticks, you just put them in water. They're so good, they're so good. Um, they're just like stick packets. It still counts as water, <laughs> I mean, in there. So I like these and I like to put them in my unsweet iced tea as well. Like they have peach, so good with unsweet tea. It tastes like um, peach tea. So that collagen has been another one. And then the savory, so that was like the sweet, the sa more, is that the right word? It's the um, mushroom breakthrough salted caramel. They do also have chai and chocolate. It doesn't taste like mushroom at all, but it has collagen in it. That is amazing. So collagen, 
collagen. And then the other anti-aging stuff, my neck. You can tell in someone's neck. <laughs> you can tell in their neck. Like, I was just talking, I had, um, a couple months ago, I had had these lines on there and they're gone. And you may be like, Elizabeth, was it your neck cream? I gotta tell the truth and shame the devil. The lines that I had going across this way that looked like, um, and they were, I, I don't know what they're from, how they're from, but they were like lines. I had Botox to get rid of those. So FYI, I feel like I always have to give you guys full transparency and like full disclosure. I got Dr. Neiman over at um, Blossom Aesthetics. It's Winchester Blossom Aesthetics here in Virginia. If you live in Northern Virginia, go to her. If you live in West Virginia, if you live in North Carolina or wherever, if you can get to, she's in Winchester, Virginia, highly recommend. And the pricing is so much cheaper than Northern Virginia pricing. I used to go over the mountain there. Um, she's board certified anesthesiologist, super smart. Anyways, she did the Botox on my neck. And so like my neck, I had my gobble gobble on here. I've been using my neck creams. So there's three. The first one is the Crepe Race, love it. Higher packaging though, it's bougie, but I like the packaging on it. I don't like the packaging really on the Curex, but I love the actual product. So this is substantially cheaper neck cream. And then I have been testing the Go Pure one. I'll link that down below. That's like the Tic Tac viral one. You can get it on Amazon and you can actually get it with faster shipping um, with their Titan and Lifting Cream on there too. And I like those. That's great. My other thing, I got into a big conversation today with another viewer because they were asking me about Sol de Janeiro. Yes, queen, I use that for my body, not for my neck, not for my face, I don't do that. But the um, scrub, oh my gosh, it's a game changer. I didn't realize, like I haven't done my hands today, how, ooh, there's age, ooh, that was, ooh, brother, ooh. <laughs> this looks older than I thought. Oh my God, on the monitor, I have a monitor right here. The monitor is like, Bleh. I gotta put some stuff on those spots. Anyways, um, I didn't do it today. It was the point that I was trying to make with my Sol de Janeiro scrub. It is awesome. It has like these poppy seeds in it. It's delicious. That and then the um, Baja Fleur Elasti Cream. You know, my number one body one is the Crepe Erase, but this is number two. And I didn't do it today. I'm gonna do, I have my rings on, so I'm like weird about lotion in my rings. So it's just some things that help me with anti-aging. Cause I know I, I know I have had a glow up. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm, it sounds like I'm being braggadocious, but I'm not, like it's it's fact. Like my body has just changed from losing so much weight and from GLP-1 medication. And so I wanna keep up with it. Like doing my makeup, doing my hair, many of you have commented on that. You're like, I love doing my hair and makeup now. I'm like, I know me too. Like I used to not care about that stuff. And now it's not that I care about it, but I really actually enjoy, I enjoy it. I enjoy it quite a bit. I enjoy it quite a bit. So I hope that that helps you. And then the other big one, um, I didn't mean to talk about this, but it was just randomly on the set. It's my gem um, jelly vitamins. They're, it's awesome. I love them. They're really, really good. This has been one of my things that I've been having for months and months and months and months and months. I will link that down below. They are giving graciously the Countess of Shopping community 50% off of any, 50% um, off the first month's purchase. Their stuff is nice. Oh, oh, I forgot to tell you guys. And Tatcha. I love Tatcha. This is their travel bag because I've been traveling so much recently. But I love Tatcha's skincare. Now, I use skincare, Zio skincare, which is prescription based skincare from Dr. Lynn Neiman. But Tatcha's stuff is fantastic. 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 So I'll link all the Tatcha stuff down below. In particular, the Dewy Skin Cream. They have one that's, they're bigger than this. Um, the blue one, it's like light blue. It's also a cream as well. And then their rice wash is nice and I like it, but I'm not like crazy, like, ah, like this I'm crazy for. Crazy, crazy. I love it. Love the texture. Love the way the end result is. This is nice. Their um, Tatcha rice, it's, it's nice, but I'm not like goo goo gaga over it. And then what's the other one? Um... If you like essences, their essence is nice as well. Again, I'm not crazy goo goo gaga over it. Where I do, and this is their, um, I haven't even tried their cleansing oil. I haven't even tried that one. Uh, oh, here. Bum, bum, ba, ba, ba. This dewy skin cream. If you have drier skin. Now they have, you can see on their, uh, on the Amazon shopping list, you can see if you have dry skin combo or um, oily skin. They've got for whatever your skin type is. I love it. 
Love it, and it's big, so it lasts. I mean, that is it lasts a long time. Anyways, kind of obsessed, but I do like their little travel container. So those are some of my, some of my other. I'm trying to think if there was any. Those are my main anti-aging things, and then of course retinols. Now I've scaled back with retinols. Full disclosure too. Um, I have done laser stuff and I have been doing retinol, but I scaled back on retinols because I was out in the sun so much this summer. And so that has also slowed down. It's, it's, I have some of my aging spots are coming back because I'm not using as much retinol on my face. So I like keeping you guys in the loop, giving you guys a little update. I know you guys like the updates on it. And so that's my update. And so instead of going back to like full throttle retinol stuff, I was like, we decided, um, I'm just going to have a laser procedure. <laughs> Near Prime Day, near Prime Day that's coming up. I'm like, it's got to be not near, I'm like planning the laser stuff around my Prime Days because, you know, that's one of my big things here at Countess of Shopping. So I think those are my, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Oh, um, no, I think those are my main. And then, of course, protein too, like eating a nutritious diet, like what I'm eating. Am I having fruits, vegetables, of course, like food sources? That matters too, obviously. But I'll link down below the article. I'll link down below all my fun stuff, my anti-aging stuff. I love talking about, it's so fun for me. It's so fun for me talking about, like, I just love trying different, like, skincares and makeups and lotions and all of the things. Um, your question of the day, what are you doing today to move you closer to your goals? I had coffee before I came on today. I realized I talked very fast. The count made me some coffee, and so <laughs> forgive me. This was an old dog, by the way. This was an old dog. We used to walk with our dog walking company that we owned a long time ago. We've since sold it. It's one of the top dog walking companies in the nation. It's one of our clients' dogs, and she did watercolors, and she put it on this mug. Is that not so cute? Dog's name was Sadie. It's one of my favorite mugs. Um, your emoji of the day is going to be a dog in honor of Sadie. <laughs> I can't wait to finish. I stopped drinking my coffee. I can't wait to go back and drink it. Sweet friends, be kind to yourself. Oh, and the emoji of the day, if you don't know, it helps me to get to know you better because I care. Seeing your name pop up video after video will help me to get to know you. I'm like, oh. And, you know, I have hundreds of videos. So I really, when people like binge watch them or things like that, I get to really know you well. And it makes my heart so happy. So, um, and I will also pray over you. If you don't believe in prayer, I'll uplift you in positive thought. If you are also not on my um, weekly emails, I send them out on Mondays and Thursdays. You can get that down on countessofshopping.com. It's on my website. There's a little pop-up that happens. And they're, they're encouragement, twice a week encouragement to help keep your mindset focused. If you've not opened that email recently, I'm taking a ton of people off my email list. So just make sure you open that email. <laughs> It will keep you on the it will keep you on the email list if you open it up. But if you just keep ignoring it, like I'm not gonna pay, I pay I pay to send it. Uh, I'm not gonna continue to pay for you to ignore me. <laughs> you know what I mean? And, and so open that email if you haven't already this week. Okay. And if you have any questions on that, just shoot me an email. My email's in the description link below, or you can re-sign up again. Um, sweet friends, be kind to yourself, be kind to others. I'm Candice for Shop and count my blessings because life is so delicious. I look forward to seeing you guys again tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye guys.